everyone we are getting ready to go away for new years we're heading to pakaiapo bay beautiful lake taupo if you saw that little short video we did can't wait to go snorkeling boy do we have a great episode for you today if you're new here we're the leopards from rotorua new zealand and this was how we saw the new year in at pakaiapo bay at lake taupo we've got some great camping tips for you and some great video footage isn't toby so cute when he sleeps this campground is free to camp at, but you have to be self-contained, so you need water, toilet, and grey tank to stay here. All right, we made it. It's a bit, uh, bit close to the edge on some of those corners, but we're here, we'll find a spot to camp. It's very busy as expected, but still plenty of space, and the weather is beautiful. And look, someone else in our next gen's here too. Pro tip, when you're looking for somewhere to park, think about the sun and where it's going to be in the afternoon when you're sitting around having a cold drink. Never did the jockey wheel up this up when we left. Lucky it stayed on. <laughs> this is my uh, one of my favourite snacks ever, the old reduced cream dip with uh, mixing the onion and the tomato together. Means I've got to make a double dose, but it's going to last me this camping trip, hopefully. It's time to go for a swim. It's time to go for a swim. She's pretty windy down there. The lake level was really high, which didn't leave much room for people to find a spot to sit or sunbathe in. Getting ready for some pad thai noodles. So we've got the pad thai gun here, the noodles, the veggies, just frying off the chicken and man I can tell you it smells so good in here. Oh beautiful. Three pad thais, one vegetarian and two chicken. Kids what do you think, of, does it look yum? Yum. <laughs> Go and taste it. It's so good. <laughs> and if you're wondering where Sophie is, she had to stay behind and work, but we thought we'd get an extra day in while the sun was shining. So if you're bringing in a large vehicle or a caravan into Pakaipo Bay, just got to be careful of this kind of bank. It's like, you know, it's pretty high on me. So you don't want to hit the back end of your caravan. We came pretty close on our way in, so just watch out for that. About three or four years ago, me and Soph were doing this half marathon race in Taupo, and all these hills were covered in snow. It was freezing. It was a pretty cold run, that's for sure. It was even um, a bit of snow on the course which is uh, pretty rare for this part of the country. <laughs> Soph's joined us now. Going for a swim because it's hot. We're going swimming, the wind's completely died off now. The weather is perfect. Let's go. If you've been anywhere near the central part of the North Island of New Zealand over the summer, it has been so hot and this lake was just a godsend to cool off in. Trust you and jump down 
I'll keep my status quo up here Won't let anybody come near I'll fix it on my own But how long can I keep up the pace To fool myself I don't need grace Right, I will give you five dollars if you run in and put that in. Go, run, go. So hard to let go. Why it's so hard to let go. <laughs> Get him <on>. up. <laughs> Pretty happy we decided to come camping here for New Year's. Me and Jade are going on a big hike back to the camp, 13 kilometers. I've got my running shoes on. I left all my running footwear in the other car back at home, so I'm in jandals for this. It's a glorious day, look at that sky, it's going to be great. This is a beautiful hike and it's great that it takes you straight back to the campground. There's an optional loop that takes about another 10 kilometres if you wanted to do that, but 13 kilometres was far enough in jandals. Also, plenty of people doing it on bikes. Sure, is a beautiful day. Feet are going all right so far. We're four k's in. The the shade is really good. It's pretty hot. And look, I think we've just reached the fork in the trail. Jade is such a ledger, no moaning, gets on and gets it done. How are you going girl? It's so hot. <laughs> Tell you what, we're cooking man, it's hot. We've done about 9.2 kilometres, no idea how far to go, it's said 13 but And here it is, we made it to the lookout. If you're not from New Zealand, this is Lake Taupo, which is New Zealand's biggest lake. All right, how you going, girl? Oh, it's so hot. Woohoo! Woohoo! And then we were almost back. And there we have it. We are back to the road. High five. That was a great walk, but time to head back for some cold beverages, I think bacon and eggs, and then we're hitting the lake. So see you after. Today was actually my birthday, and so I've cooked the best feed for me and Jade when we finished our run, and my sister and Ryan and their kids came to visit us as well. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing.
The girls have been doing a few fashion models here, designer towels. My beautiful cow. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are hilarious. And then I put on some pants. <laughs> Look, we found this little bunny in the grass and we caught him. And he's so cute. Toby found him. No, I What did, did you think he was, Toby? I found him. I thought he was a mouse. You said, no, oh, a little mouse. You I did think he was, was a mouse. Bunny. You said, look at mouse. <laughs> What's his that name? That can be carrot. <laughs> carrot. Um, let's call him carrots, yeah. Yeah, let's call him carrot. Can we carrots see him the, the bunny? Carrots the bunny. Cool, well if you have made it this far, thanks heaps for watching. If you're not a subscriber, then jump on board our journeys. We're preparing to go to Camp America this year. We've already got our airline tickets, and we've got heaps of cool adventures planned for this summer as well. So subscribe and follow along and help our channel to grow. We'll see you next time. Balancing on a weary line Too scared to trust you and jump down